everybody, welcome back to Nightmare of Decay. Where we left off, we were gonna see what's in that little vent uh, in the ceiling. Now, I don't know if you can hear it, but it is currently raining. I would turn up my mic right now, but uh, my laptop is far more, far louder than the rain will ever be. So yeah, we're gonna, we, we're gonna go ahead and see where this vent leads to with this ladder. Yeah. Uh, it says push, not hump. Please do not hump the ladder, sir. Sir. Sir, stop humping the ladder. Sir. Okay, well. All right, there we go. We got the ladder right up to the vent. Let's see what kind of death and destruction follows here. All right, I'm assuming, yeah. Hey, that's the that stuff we need Um, for the acid recipe. Uh, yeah, lanolin. Lanolin? Yeah, lanolin. Oh, and awesome, a safe place. Because I always forget. I thought I picked up some ammo? I guess not. All right, let's go. Whoa. Oh, come on. Okay. Oh, wonderful. Mr. Wanna get your bones is out. Oh, what? Fuck you. And your chicken strips. Boom! Dead. Alright, there we go. What did we need in there? Well, yeah, the jar of lanolin, but that's about it. Now, if you remember last episode, we also got the spade key. And I, while I was recording, I could not remember where the hell that door was. But as, when I was editing, I was like, I saw that it was this door. So we're going to head on through here and I guess we're killing some dudes. And boom. Oh, yeah. My favorite. The pots. Sir, can you die? Can you just stop walking? Thank you. The rules are, I shoot you, you stop walking. That's how this works. God damn. I will assume that is the flesh wall they are talking about. Actually, I could, I can inspect it. Yeah, flesh wall. It's a wall made out of something, some strange fleshy growth. Maybe I can solve it with something. Yeah, probably acid. What's in here? Oh, wonderful. Oh, yeah. Gotta love the... Ooh, look. Oh, yeah. Uh, this probably... This goes to the bust of the king. Not his titties. But his head. And not that head. Well, I mean, it's kind of obvious what we do here. But... <laughs> I would assume... This pushes out, because he's facing the wrong way. If we just put him there. Oh, I can't even get around him to push him. Okay. So I'm assuming this pushes out. That's not even the right shape. This pushes out to, so that we can get to the side of him. And I would assume this thing rotates. Yeah. Instincts, you know. Instincts are just amazing. They're just what I'm what I'm built for. The instincts. Oh. Actual people. oh. Oh, they're speaking a different language. They're definitely definitely cultists. Oh. oh shit, they shoot you?
Thank you for dying. Okay. Ah, uh, yes, our health drinks. Oh, you dead, bro. Where's the other one? Yeah, I knew there was another. Really? Bro, these guys got sharp shooting. There we go. Alright, uh, I don't have any... Oh, I kind of figured I could pick those up. I mean, what kind of game gives enemies guns and doesn't allow you to take them? Alright, let's see what's over here. We're already facing this way. Alright, so... Otazon! Yep, that's another thing we need, and... Alright, need to find a square-shaped whatever the fuck. Anything over here? Ooh, a chest! <laughs> oh! Oh, no, 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 no! God damn. Why, thank you, sir. Thing. <laughs> I didn't expect it to pull a Dark Souls on me. Think, is my camera too high? Ah, yes. You can see all of Bold and Brash now. There you go. I, I know that's got what you guys want to see. Is just Bold and Brash. Well, that was a whole magazine, clip, magazine, I don't freaking know, man. Uh, diamond, okay. And, and, gone. What's in here? Well, there's definitely something to get in there. But what's over here? Hey, some pistol ammo. Oh, and a health drink. Yeah, I'm collecting those. Tear stain note. And what has happened to my husband? It's almost like William has become a completely different person. Now he even spends his nights down in the basement, and I can't remember the last time we slept in the same bed together. We barely even speak to each other anymore. Even more worrying, some servants have gone missing and strange things have been happening around the manor. Just last night I heard a horrid breathing sound coming from the wardrobe. It kept me up all night. I tried to tell William about it, but he just ignored me and walked away like a bitch. I'm beginning to fear for my life. I can't live like this anymore. Why, hello there. Oh, I would assume that's your body. Yep, that's a body, all right. The decapitated body of a middle-aged woman lay sprawled on top of the bed. A trail of blood is leading from the body to a bloody wardrobe. And let's see what's in here. Nothing, because I can't open it. That's the best way to think about it. If you can't open it, there's nothing in there that you need. That crush, crush. Oh, okay. Yeah. Oh no. What's in here? Wait. What up? What did it? There's something else that like landed on for a second. I thought at least. Okay. The toilet is clogged with disgusting filth. The stench coming from it is extremely pungent. You notice there is something stuck in the toilet. Reach in and get- Of course we are! I got coffee, so I don't have to watch that. I would assume that will open that door with the Odazon behind it. Hey buddy, how you doing? Oh 
Oh, come on. You couldn't have done that, like, a little sooner? I wasted all my damn ammo on you. What's in here? Oh! Alright. I like the sound of that. It brings you back to the main area. That's always nice. Listen, man. I don't want any problems. I don't want to fight you, Flash. I wouldn't want to fight me neither. <laughs> uh, okay. I think I had... Yeah. What's in here? Alright. Hey, ammo! I need that stuff. That stuff is really nice. Alright. Let's save. There we go. Alright, let's see. So, we got this door that leads to somewhere. I need a diamond key. Oh, yeah. I got the square crank. So, I can go down and open the door over here with the Otazon behind it. I am so glad that this game does not respawn enemies every time you leave a room. Like, how annoying would that be? Darth Otazon, is that all of it? Yeah! Alright. Now we gotta go all the way the fuck back to the main area. To the right side. And go to the little lab area. So it's a little bit of a trek. I will see you there. Alright, here we are. Oh, that's a pretty blue. I like that red. Man, that's okay, I guess. <laughs> Alright. Mm, I did not like that sound. I kind of just like watching it on my recording sometimes. Because I have a screen here. Literally right behind you guys. See? There you are. Ah! Right there. Screenception. But yeah. I have, a, I have my monitor right there so I can see everything. There we go. Alright, now we gotta go melt the flesh wall that's all the way the fuck back in nowhere land. So I'll see you over there. Alright, here we are. Sharp acid on it. Bye bye, flesh. Hey, the diamond key! See, I'm just too good for this game. I am just too good. Now, where does that diamond kit? No, I'm joking. Let <laughs> me go up here. Got a lot of walking to do. I would cut this, but, you know, it's not really enough to cut. A friend? Oh, I don't like the music. All right, not a friend. We do not have a friend. Good old cabin key though. A suicide note. To my dearest Lucy. I know that this letter will probably never reach you, but I had to at least leave but something behind. If only to give me a peace of mind before I do what must be done. I don't know how many days or even weeks it's been since I've been trapped in this horrid place. I remember falling asleep beside you only to wake up in a nightmare. A nightmare that never ends. As I sit here and prepare to take my own life, I wonder if I will finally awaken to find myself next to you in bed. Or if I will enter my eternal sleep, never to see you again. I love you, Lucy. Pray for me. Hey, some gun Oh. 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 <laughs> oh. A magnum. Oh, I like the sound of that. Uh, let me re-scramble everything. 
I think I'm gonna put the most powerful weapons at the top. Uh, that's gonna go there, and then, yeah, dynamite will stay at five. I don't really need the pellet gun in my, I don't really need the pellet gun in my, um, main art, <laughs> main artillery, yes. Um, alright, where the fuck am I going? <laughs> I know, I'm assuming this cabin key goes to the one outside. Yeah, in the courtyard. But, I forget what I was saying. Dang it. Out to where the doggy was and our friend that's dead on the ground that was being eaten by doggies and... He's still not looking too good. I don't think, I, I don't think he's coming back. Why, hey there. <laughs> How you doing? You see a drunken man drinking from a bottle. His eyes are sunken in and there's a haunted, tired look on his face. I'm just, I don't, I think it's an AI voice, but if it isn't, I'm just imagining someone going into a mic going, what, 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 what? Like, you can't tell me that's not funny. I see that this horrid place has slain yet another victim. Before you ask, I have no idea what this place is or how I got here. I'm probably the same as you. Woke up here after going to sleep. <laughs> oh, his, his mouth falls. <laughs> I never noticed that. After getting chased by some rabid dogs, I managed to escape into this cabin and lock myself in. Imagine my surprise to discover that the cabin was filled with boxes of booze. Man, that is a good way to die. <laughs> if I'm gonna meet my end in this place, I definitely don't want to be sober when it happens. The drunken man pauses to take a drink from his bottle. <laughs> Someone, tri <laughs> Someone tried to get inside earlier, was slamming the door, begging to be let in. I ignored him. No way I was going to open that door with all those monsters outside. I'm pretty sure those dogs got them. The horrid scream. <laughs> the horrid screams as they ripped him apart like a squealing pig mixed with a crying baby. Something I will never be able to forget. I'm probably next. <laughs> As at least I have this booze king to company before I die. <laughs> well, you have fun there, buddy. Drink your life away. That's all that there is to do in this place now. Hey. Hey, another crank. I think we can do the king puzzle thing now. Oh. Oh, this boy about to... Oh, yeah, he about to die. Yeah. Oh, another cultist? And now they... Al dente. What does that mean? Al dentes. I, I think it's Spanish. And I'm, I'm not saying that because it sounds Spanish. I know a little bit of Spanish. Not a lot. Dude could not handle the skill. I'm gonna take one of those. I have enough. I might as well. Oh, are these gonna be the main enemies now? Why are there freaking cultists here? And why haven't I seen them until now? One. I need. Okay, so they always move after they shoot. Oh, come on. Screw you. There we go. That was stupid. Fuck you. That's why you died. Camper. 
Well, there we go. And more <laughs> shotgun ammo. Nice. All right. We're not doing the best on health right now. <laughs> All right. So we got 16 shotgun, a lot of this, five of that. Let's go. So, wait, what did I get? Oh, yeah, hexagon crank. I'm assuming that goes to the uh, place we were at earlier with the... Um, with the knights in that room with the crown. I would assume that's where we go next, and I'm, I'm thinking that's where we're going to use um, the crank. If my understanding is correct, I mean, you can't tell me that doesn't look like that square. See? Like, there was just no other thing it could be. And then, oh no, he's humping the soldiers now. Alright, and hexagon. You only do a quarter? Dude, just turn it around all the way. Alright, here we go. Two, three, four, five, six. There we go. Now we can give this to the king, which I am pretty sure will be a boss, because if you remember in the, on the plaque on the bust, it says, return his crown and then fight his warriors or some shit like that. So that is on the other side, where I do not remember. It may be here. Hey. Yeah, here. Let's let's read this. Present the king with his golden crown and defeat his loyal guard. Yeah. So the, I mean, I I think this is pretty obvious what's gonna happen here. All four of these are probably are gonna come to life, and I'm gonna have to fight them. I if I guess I take out the bow guys first. Un unless it does one at a time, but I don't. That would be too easy. Oh, and the door locks. Wonderful. I did not save. Alright. Time to see how this magnum how well this magnum works. Oh yo. Oh shit. I didn't realize he was already on my ass. I missed. Okay. We have one left. Where's my shotgun? Okay. Okay, that guy's gone. That guy's gone. One more magnum. Oh, I hit them both. Okay. Let's take out. I don't want to waste all my really good ammo. have a melee weapon, I got a fucking shotgun. Woo! 
Well, I did it. <laughs> I did it. <laughs> Woo! I don't even know if I talked through that. Pretty sure I did, though. I tend to talk a lot. And we're out of Magnum. Hopefully we... Hopefully that wasn't a... Oh, this is all you get. Alright, I guess we're gonna use the pistol a little. Health drink. Lord's Diary. We finally moved into the new manor. Irma was against it, but <laughs> I managed to convince her. I'm sure she'll fall in love with this place in no time at all. It also helped that the price of for the manor was dirt cheap. Something about horrific murders in the past and it being haunted, but I don't care. Piff paff, I was taking a bath. I was drawn to this manor from the first moment I laid eyes on it, almost as if it was calling out to me. Which, I'm sorry, if something is calling out to you like that, run. Alright, let's see. What are we getting ourselves into? Actually, I think I'll go with the shotgun. Thank you for dying. Alright, buddy. Alright, this can go one way. This can go one of one way. Like that. One way or another, you're gonna die. I'm gonna shoot you, shoot you, shoot you. Thank you. Alright. Any more ammo? No? Okay, that's the way we came in. Let's head out this way, see what's over here. Woo! Oh, dogs. Wonderful. Alright, let's see. Do I have? Yeah. Oh. <laughs> oh, yeah, I hate these dogs. Oof. Big oof. Another? Uh, I can't open it. Okay. Alright, let us continue. Carry on my wayward son. Tell pee peace when you are done. What the hell is this pa doing over here? Don't you die no more. You're welcome. Alright. So, we can't do anything over there. There was an... Yeah, there's another door over here. Alright, let's see what's over here. Okay. Oh, you guys are pretty damn close together. I may be able to get a two for... No? Thank you. There's a door over here. I need to pull out the pistol. What's behind? Locked from the other side. Okay. So what's over here then? Okay. We got a ladder, another door, anything. Ooh, what's this? Bolt cutters. Oh yeah, there's a chain on that door back there. I guess, so do I still have that jar? Okay. All right. <laughs> oh yeah. What do we get? Uh, looks like pistol, shotgun. Oh, is that Magnum? And a first aid kit. Okay. And try to get as high a score as possible with the allotted time. Score points by hitting targets. Headshots score double. Time can be extended by hitting blue target. Oh yeah. Here we go. I'm ready. Oh, 
score by a hundred points nice all right let's reload let's get all of our weapons loaded oh oh that I love that that is it's just so much fun for no reason well for a reason but it's just it's so much fun but that is, that currently is my, I see you. Thank you. Uh, more. I don't remember what Sounds sounds familiar. Stay back. Like the actual sound used there sounds familiar. Damn. Damn. Do I just have to shoot them, like, square in the middle of the forehead to do it? Nope. Woo! There we go. Okay, I saw the ladder. I want to see what's over here first. Anything over here? Hey! Ah, oh, shit. I'm running low. Thank you. Any more ammo? Nope. God damn. How many of you guys are there? Any more ammo? Hey, some shotgun ammo. Nice. That's not bad. I will take any ammo. Even Pelican ammo, even though it's unlimited. Ooh, okay. Don't mind if I do. Hey, and another empty jar. Okay. Uh, yeah, obviously. Okay. So there was the bolt cutters back from where we came from, which we need to get those. So we need to grab those bolt cutters, and then there was a chained door. Actually, there's been a couple of chained doors. Um, I want to see where this goes quickly since we're here. Okay, another chained door. Let's save. And let's continue on our way. Alright, let's get the bolt cutters. Uh, jar of acid. So the jar goes away after you use it, which is kind of interesting. I didn't think of that. Okay, chain door should be in this area? I honestly do not remember. Yeah, this area. Um, I don't know the fastest way to it. Right here. Bolt cutters. What's in here? Okay, um... <laughs> Woo! Yeah, 
I'm not. <laughs> no. I don't. <laughs> no. The body of an insane woman, even death, she has a manic smile on her face. You remember that the creature in the whole wanted female head sports collection? Yes. See, I told you. I don't care that it's a weird creature. Um. I think if I help him, he will help me. That's how I feel about this. So I'm going to help him. And hopefully he leaves me alone. Okay. So, then there were bolt cutters. Oh, wait, yeah. The chain door at the end of where we were at. Yep. All right. Let's overwrite that. There we go. And let's just take a little look-see. What's behind this door? Oh, hell no. That is 100% a boss. That is 100. Look at that dude. Got torn in half and is half his body. Yeah, no. That's going to be for next video. So if you like this video, please leave a like. Comment on the games you think I should play. Subscribe to the certain new bell. Don't be afraid of those ghosts. I'll see you guys in the next video. Goodbye.